so in a way Mattel basically failed us not with the toys per se but um what I mean is this is the issue with the distribution or uh, the way the um this line has been handed out across the world um and it's probably worst in the UK. I uh, you know, I'd say the UK gets it the worst. Um and yeah, some of you might think I'm being a bit biased just because I live in the UK. But I have evidence, not photographic evidence, otherwise I would have added it in. But I saw a video um, and someone in Canada recorded uh, they went to Target or Walmart no they went to Walmart I believe and like the shelves were full with Jurassic World stuff Um even I believe it was some of the Dino Ravels which you know, we uh, the UK are getting some, except I don't believe we're getting the Concaminator. We're not getting the Albertosaur. I believe the main two that I know we're getting is the Parasaur and the Bite and Fight T-Rex, which I don't really care for. Um, but. They've got all sorts of exclu uh, exclu I know I'm being a bit childish and stuff, but really, in you know, if you think about it in America, for the legacy line, they've got E. Malcolm, um, Alan Grant, Robert Muldoon, uh, Ellie Sattler, and then you you know you turn towards the UK, we've not got any. Um, Like, we've not got, we don't have Ellie, we don't have Alan, we don't have Ian, we don't have Robert. We have the Jeep, but we don't have any of the human characters to go in the Jeep. You know, we have the T-Rex. You know, but we're not getting that uh, um, Bull Rex and the Baby. Which I would have really liked, because I really like the Bull Rex. Everyone likes the Bull Rex. Um, a few days ago, on Monday, I went to the Entertainer, which is um, like Smith's or Toys R Us, and I went in and I went to the Jurassic World aisle which is the smallest aisle in the world um, for human characters they literally only had or, um, Lockwood Battle Owen and uh, Wheatley and they only had the Demorphodon um, for the attack pack and then they had the 40 pound uh, Rex, which in Smiths it's almost thirty pound, and I know I'm being basically it's like I'm really annoyed because I'm never really got uh, you know it's like there's a high chance I'd say an eighty percent chance you know that. We won't that um, we in the UK won't really get to see the Alan, the Ellie, the, the most of the Legacy Collection line. Um, we won't get to see that 
um, Indoraptor and Blue uh, duo set. Won't be able to get that. Um, see the story packs that they have. The Owen and Blue one, and then the Claire and the Jarvis here. Won't be able to see the um, Franklin Webb and uh, Zia Rodriguez. Um, we d we have no battle damage. Um, we don't have any. Literally, the only two um, Rorvors I have is the Ceratosaurus and the Metricamsaurus. Um, because they're not. Um, I believe they still have the Allosaurus and stuff in America and stuff like that. Um, but, you know, the rest of the world also have the Suchomimus, that one, the Carnotaurus. I mean, we only just managed to get the Spinosaurus. Oops. Uh, like, my mum said, like, she literally had to persuade someone down at Smith's. Uh, just to send it to uh, a closer Smiths and for them to ship it over. You know, so it's like I'm lucky to have one of the rarest uh, figures in the line. Um, another one is the Owen and Baby Blue literally I, um, and the Maisie set um, the, um, my mum I, I believe my mum literally had to ship it over because I wanted the Owen and, um, Owen and stuff the uh, and the baby blue. Yeah, but well, it's like the only three, four, um, Mattel figures that I have, uh, for humans is Claire, uh, Wheatley. Oh, wait, I also have, uh, Lockwood Owen and, uh, baby blue Owen. And then they, they have the, uh, they don't have it now, because it's out of stock. Also, one that I really wanted, or two that I really wanted, that was, that's only in Canada and America, they're only distributing them there, selling them there, is the, the Jurassic World, uh, like, uh, we're already on the topic of dresser was the Baryonyx bunker set, um, and then the Quest for Indominus Rex set, which comes with a Morza submarine. Like they don't even have half of that stuff uh, over here. Um, I know the game beef managed to get quite a few stuff. Uh, you got the Carnotaurus. Where he is, um, but as I said, they're not selling them anymore over here. So, yeah, if there's one thing that needs to be improved, people said, literally, uh, quite a lot of people said, um. They they'd be happy with Mattel, you know, if um, they actually got the distribution right, the 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 way that the places to sell. Like really, they should do in equal quantities, right? You can have these, and you know, uh, or, or you can have all this, and then you can have all of this. Instead of just going, you can have this, all of this, I mean, and then you can have some of this, just because 
I don't know, I feel like the reason why they did it is because um I feel like the reason we, uh, why they did it is because uh, we got to see Jurassic World first, which came out on the 6th. Um, you know, but then again, that's that like saying we should have gotten Jurassic World Evolution on the 22nd and they, uh, you know, the rest of all gets it on the 12th. You know, a bit of a silly excuse. I mean, Spain got to see it on the... Uh, like the end, uh, end of May. Uh, I know that. <clears throat> Cause you, cause it was a premiere. But like, what Hasbro did right is the distribution. They didn't do right with the toys because they were all messed up and broke five minutes after you opened them. Um, like I, the only real one I had was the Indominus Rex and Jarity, which was considered the best one in the line. You know, it's like okay, Mattel have just announced. A, bre a massive Brachiosaurus figure. I bet, I bet they won't be selling it in the UK. They'll say, um, uh, they're only uh, selling it in America and Canada. Um, so that really um aggravates me um yes and while it's childish the way i think it's the truth um even the game beaver commented on it like we've got nothing here um and while you know the the rest of the world has everything I mean yeah some parts gets uh, more than others but just because Mattel's an American company doesn't mean I think it's an American company right if it is right it's because I'm an idiot that doesn't mean you only get to sell all your stuff in America. Um, you know. And there's an issue with the Godzilla distribution to the UK. They don't sell anything to the UK. Just because they don't. You know. Toho even said. They don't want. Uh, Godzilla stuff to be sold to the UK. Like ever. It was actually rare that we somehow managed to get the uh, the Bandai 2014 stuff. Not the good stuff, but the really crappy stuff. So yes, um, I know this was a bit of a rant. Um, but I think I should have should just address this all to you. Um Mattel up your game. Um it's really poor and leaves a poor rep uh reputation. So uh, yeah. Uh, fix your ways, Mattel. Try and sell more stuff to the UK because I'm very patriotic. Um, leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Um, please watch this video. No one's gonna watch it anyway because that's just for <laughs> that's just a uh, high puzzle. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.